So I wanted to shoot a quick intro to a video that I um, had just shot that I'll uh, link on after this, or I'll paste on after this to show the Torsen limited slip front differential. I had done a video a year ago right after I bought the truck uh, to feature how the limited slip front differential does because I really couldn't find a good video on the internet that focused in on you know how well the wheels in the front actually uh, you know spin in unison with each other uh, because you know there's a lot of debate over whether you can go with a um, you know whether a locking differential on the front like you get the ZR2 or a limited slip front differential is better uh, so I think the video I just shot gives you a better view certainly did I mainly did it for myself because I wanted to see what the wheels were doing because um, you know you can't see when you're driving uh, but it's interesting that they pretty much always spin at the same time the second you have any slippage so it really behaves like a locking front differential at least in you know icy or snowy conditions which is great because you know you can be in four-wheel auto or four-wheel high and the second your four-wheel drive kicks in you're getting a true four-wheel drive versus if you had locking differentials uh, most vehicles with locking differentials up front you have to go into four-wheel low to use them but at the very least you have to stop and press the button you know kind of get it going but this is automatic so my experience having a limited slip front differential uh, is way better than a locking differential if you're actually doing like rock climbing and you have one wheel in the air you know, it's probably probably better to have a locking differential but great thing about this is it un, you know unlocks itself if you're making a tight turn so and you never have to press a button it's just kind of always there and how often is are you actually rock climbing with uh, any vehicle you know unless you're really taking it somewhere to specifically do that so anyway i'll put the video at the end of this but i thought it was pretty cool okay we're gonna do another video shooting the uh torsen front limited slip differential uh have should have better lighting this time so i can see the tires so we're gonna give it a shot the objective is not to make it up the hill i set myself up so i know you know we're already on a dead spot in the ice so i just want the tires to spin i'm not trying to make it up the hill <laughs> 